Hey, what's up everybody? Today I'll be making a quick video showing y'all how to fix the lag issue in Crisis 3. Alright. Um I think there's like I think there's like a couple of things you're gonna you're gonna need. Maybe like one or two things that you'll need to fix it. Fix this. And um this is not the official fix, but as of right now it it works well for me and it runs runs smooth and I will show you my specs um, let's go to properties advanced nope sorry wrong thing hold on a second while it loads up uh... no oh it shows up on here sorry well, yeah, this is my specs right here, the AMD A6, 3400 APU, um, I have it overclocked at 1.8 gigahertz, um, I have 12 gigs of RAM, 64-bit operating system. Um, when I first installed this game, I had a lot of issues, um, it seemed like no matter what I did, I had everything on low and I would still get like low frames well so today I actually finally found out a way how to how to um, how to fix that lag um, let me actually show it to you right now uh, let's see let's see so like I said there's it's like two things you're gonna need you're gonna need this program called timer resolution um, I don't, well, yeah, you'll need this program, I'll provide it in the link. Um, not sure how this works, but all I know is that, all I know is that you double click on it, you run it, and then you just click maximum. And then from there on, you just run the game. But before you even do that, there's actually a couple of steps, a couple other things you ought to do. Um, let me put this back to the default settings. Oh, well, it does it for you automatically. All right. So if you have AMD, you would go to your. Sorry for the noise in the background. It's my nephew. Um, you would go to your AMD graphics setting. So do that before you uh you do the timer re resolution thing. So just wait for this to come up. And if you have Intel, you would, you know, do the same thing. You know, go to your graphic settings and, and um, you know, you just you'll go to you know your 3D application. I think it's the same thing for Intel. I'm not sure, but um, you know, once you get into that, you know, you just make sure you have everything, you know, just set to to low, or just make sure you set it to to on performance. All right. Um, and that's for Intel, AMD. You know, these are the settings that I have it at. And um, make sure you. And if you have AMD, just apply it. Intel, you know. Like I said, I'm not sure. So if you get any, if you have any similar settings to this, just make sure you have them set to low. All right. So you know, X out of that. And um, the next thing you'd want to do is. Uh, go right back to that timer resolution program just have that running just press run click maximum minimize it um, then you run the game from there and another thing that I notice when you have the game set to to window windowed or windowed mode your frames will go down. Um, why I don't know. So, say for example, if you have it set to, um, gosh, I don't to to the lowest resolution for Crisis Three. I don't remember what the lowest resolution is, but um, if you have it uh set to the lowest resolution, you're still going to get low frames, and that's in window mode. But if you switch over to to full screen mode you get like a a boost your frames just like go up 
Now when I had it in window mode, windowed mode, I was getting like 20, like 20 frames per second. And I couldn't figure out why that was happening cuz with all my other games I have them in windowed mode. And you know the frames are, you know, it's pretty good. But for Crisis not so much. So if you want to get that FPS boost, make sure you put it in full screen mode. All right? Full screen mode is is what helped me and also this timer um timer resolution. Like I said, I'm not sure how this works, but uh you could um you could go to Google, you know, find it out for yourself. Yeah. And um after doing all those things, you know, applying, uh, setting the graphic settings to low, enabling the timer resolution, and um, and also setting the um, the crisis setting, setting everything to low, everything in the game, setting all the game settings to low. My um. My crisis, I, uh, my crisis game has been running, running well. I'm getting from like 20 to like 40 to 50 frames per second throughout the whole game. Now, the only problem that I have with the Crisis 3 is, is um, actually there's a there's a map on there that I haven't kind of have an issue with, and that's a jungle map. All right, so uh, for some reason, I mean, I I'm getting okay frames, but it is not the best. You can still see a lag, but all the other maps, they run perfectly, no issue. It's just the jungle map that I have an issue with. Um, let me see. Am I missing anything else? Um, I think that's about it. I will provide the timer resolution. And the link for you. I uh, sorry. And um Yeah, but just remember when you're playing, put it in full screen. If you have it in uh windowed mode, your frames will drop. And like I said, I, I don't know why it does that, but put it in full um full screen mode. So you could um um what do you call it? So you get that full, so you get your FPS boost or whatever. Alright? Alright guys, thanks for watching. I hope this video was helpful. I hope it helped you out. If you have any issues, you know, just just let me know. Alright? Um, that's about it. Alright guys, peace.